Welcome back to The Lemon Factor. I'm Chad, and in today's video, I'm gonna go over my initial impressions of our new high-performance tires. So we've recently installed these Michelin Pilot Sport 4S high-performance summer-only tires on our project car, this 10th generation Honda Accord. Now we did that because we've been adding on modifications increasing the horsepower and the torque. As a result though, the all season tires that we had on the car cannot handle all that power and they easily break loose, especially from a dig. So we opted to not only go with a dedicated summer only tire, but we also increased the width of the tire. So I've had the tires on the car for a little while and I'm ready to go through my initial impressions. If you're considering purchasing the Michelin Pilot 4S, if you're interested to see how they perform, not just on our Honda Accord, but in general, then stay tuned. Now remember, just because these tires have fantastic reviews, which is one of the reasons why I purchased them, it may not be the right tire for everybody. You may be looking for different tire characteristics than what I'm looking for. So consider that when purchasing your next tire. Before we continue, please don't forget to subscribe, turn on notifications, and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I'm really happy with these tires. They perform very well. For all the reasons why I purchased these, they are performing and in some cases exceeding my expectations. Now that doesn't mean to say these are the perfect tires for everybody. And that's why I think you should listen to a little bit of this feedback and decide for yourself. I purchased these tires for performance and that's grip primarily. Grip from a standstill when accelerating hard, grip going around corners and grip when stopping. Now stopping wasn't necessarily on my list. I didn't feel as though I needed a tire to stop better, but I'll get to that in a moment why I now bring that up. And when it comes to grip, these tires perform and they perform really well. So I will formally test these out with some zero to 60, some quarter mile, you know, maybe even some track testing, but my initial tests from a dig brake torquing is this these tires have phenomenal grip great traction off the line great traction when cornering and i say that because on occasion i would break loose the tires when going around a corner from a standstill from so from a stop sign a stoplight turns green i go give it a little bit too much the tires would squeal. I'd feel that, I'd have to back off of the throttle. I'd also feel a little bit of torque steer in the, in the wheel. It would pull the wheel. I've tried it a couple times, so I wanted to make sure that this was the case, and I don't get that anymore. I've given it a good amount of gas with a hard right or hard left, and the tires, they grip. They grip hard. There was an instance, a scary case where I had to brake hard and I was amazed, immediately amazed at how grippy these tires are that it reduced my braking distance substantially in that case, right? I don't have any data. I didn't test the before and after, but it was noticeable that they have more grip. Afterwards, I did do a couple harder stops just to test things out. And yes, they feel good. They feel really confident uh, in heavy braking. So if you're looking to purchase some new tires, please consider purchasing from Priority Tire. I'll leave the link to them below. If you purchase through that link, you're gonna be helping out the channel. So now when it comes to ride quality, it rides really well, surprisingly well, better than I thought it would. So I thought with the fact that it's a high performance tire and I've increased 
the width of the tire from a 235 to a 265, oh, wow, you know, I'm going to feel every bump. It's not going to be comfortable. And it's not the case. It is more comfortable than our previous tires. I'm not sure exactly why. It could be in part because our tire sidewall is about half inch taller than the previous. And with that sidewall, maybe it's giving me more cushion. And it's substantial enough that immediately I notice because there's this sizable, I call it a mini speed bump near where I live, that every time I go over that, it would jar the car. I would really have to slow down to hit that at a much reduced speed. With this car now on these Michelin Pilot Sport 4S tires, it soaks it right up. Steering response is really good too and obviously it's the tire high performance versus an all season probably also has a lot to do with the 265 width but it is the steering wheel is more responsive one thing i noticed as you're driving like i am now it's going to track better than the old tires i think because it's just so hunkered down with the increased contact patch that unless something disrupts it, it, it's not gonna change course. What else? Let me talk about a potential negative. I will say that the tire noise is a little bit increased. 80% of the time, it's equal to. It's no better, but it's equal to. There's a small portion, depending on the road type and the road surface, that I do get more road noise than I would have otherwise had. On the highway, a tad louder than what we had before. Another negative, which I guess I'll get over, the stickiness of this tire picks up so many pebbles, so many rocks, that I'm constantly hearing all of that spitting up in my fender well. So overall, fantastic tire. I am super impressed by it, very happy, which for the cost, I should be. These aren't cheap tires. I really was contemplating buying something cheaper, but with all the glowing reviews for this tire, I had to do it. I had to, I had to find out if it performs as well as what all the reviews indicate. And I have to say that so far it does. With all the money that you pay, that you spend on your performance modifications, these tires, a good set of grippy tires, will help in your acceleration, your cornering, and your braking. And if the performance doesn't matter, safety. The car saved my ass under heavy braking. So already, in a way, it may have paid for themselves. 